the morning in year three, we are going to make a booklet about our rainforests. So as you can see, this is my example. We have the title, we've got the four layers of the rainforest, some pictures, and then if I open it up on the inside will be where you are going to write some facts about each layer. So we've got the emergent layer at the top, canopy layer, the understory layer, and the forest floor layer. So this is what you're going to be creating today. I'm going to show you how to do this. So you're going to start with a piece of A4 paper, and we are going to just fold it in half vertically. Okay. Now when you've done that, we are going to fold it in half this way, and a half again. So we should have, when I open it up, four squares. One, two, three, and four. So we've got four layers of our rainforest. So now we can start to design on the front cover the pictures, just as I showed you earlier. So starting with the title, our emergent layer, which is right at the very top. Usually we'll see some birds up there. We come down to the canopy layer, we'll begin to see more trees, the tops of trees, with maybe some toucans, some snakes, sloths perhaps, monkeys, if you're confident drawing those. We've got the understory, mostly insects here, so as you can see we've added a butterfly. And down at the bottom on the forest floor are your larger animals, such as your cats, leopards, tigers, that you will see at the bottom. So we're going to draw on the front first. I'm going to start by putting a title, just nice, clear, capital letters. It doesn't have to be perfect, but you can take your time. Okay, so I'm going to start by drawing the top of one of the trees. I'm going to make it pretty big. The rainforest, as we know, is a large place. The trees are very tall, the trees are very high. So I'm going to start to bring the tree trunk down into the canopy layer. I'm going to add the next part of my tree, or even a separate tree. I'm going to bring it down now all the way to the forest floor. So on the forest floor, usually it's just grass and bushes. So you can add some grass, you might add some bushes as well. Okay, our understory layer is just lots of the taller leaves, plants that sort of grow, but they're not bigger. They're not big like our trees on the top. Okay, I'm quite happy with that. I do though need to add some animals to our rainforest. So on the top, I'm going to draw a bear and start with the wing. You will probably be able to do this a tiny bit better than me. Come down. And there is my bird. Okay. Uh, in the um, canopy layer then, I'm going to add a snake. I'm going to draw my snake coming down the tree. There he is, big tongue. Okay, and I am going to colour this in afterwards. Um, I'm now going to add just a butterfly here in my understory layer. You can add more animals, make it as creative as you can. Down at the bottom, I'm just going to add a cat. So I'm going to put it facing this way. Not my greatest cat, but it's okay. Okay. I've now got my front page. I'm happy with that. I'm going to colour it in. Um, but for this video, I'm not. You would do that at this point. Once I've coloured it in, I'm now going to use my scissors to cut where those creases are that we made earlier. But I'm 
only cutting on the front page. So this will create a little flap. Okay. Remember, just the front page along those creases that we made earlier where we first made the folds. So now, if I open that top bit up, I can write here about that layer. So I remember this layer is called the emergent layer. So the emergent layer is, I'm going to put dot, 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 but I would like you to fill that space. Use the PowerPoint, of course, to help you. Okay, so the next layer is the canopy layer. So again, same sort of style. You could write it in paragraphs, sentences, bullet points. That's completely up to you. The third layer towards the bottom now is the understory layer. Finally, the forest floor layer. And there you have it. That will be your information booklet about the four layers of the rainforest. Mine is a very quick example, but I look forward to seeing your creativity and the information you've learned today about rainforest. Well done and good luck, you three.